Hello, in this video we're going to talk about wax polishing musical instruments. And I know this is a really sensitive area uh, for a lot of musicians and also because of the value of a musical instrument. Uh, there's a lot of talk about sort of not polishing it and just leaving it as it is. But until now, you didn't have Gilboy's Gold, which uh, we think would work wonderful on musical instruments and so much so we not only think that, Malcolm Latcham, uh, the world famous violinist from, um, he played with three symphony orchestras, he was one of the founder members of the Academy uh, Orchestra for the Academy of St. Martins in the Fields. Um, he's played around the world and he plays for Dartington String Quartet, we played for Dartington String Quartet, and he has asked us to polish his violin that was made in 1960, 1960, possibly, I think it was 1960, we'll find out. And this is it here. Uh, so we're very privileged to have this beautiful, finely handmade violin. It was made not too far away from here, made by Rod Ward. This is number five, this is his fifth violin that he made. And it's just a wonderful instrument. So we're going to wax polish this today. Uh, I won't go through the whole process, but we'll just do the start of the wax polishing of this uh, violin. And then we'll leave the wax on there and then come back tomorrow and we'll buff it off to see the results. So let's just go ahead. I'm just going to move the box over there. Bring the violin over. So pure gold is what we're going to use to polish this violin with. Pure gold has got absolutely no colour in it whatsoever. It is a blend of the Miracle Wax, the Carnauba Wax, Japan Wax, and obviously the Beeswax from Buckfast Abbey. Uh, and now we're going to apply this to the surface of the violin. I've got one of our polishing cloths, which you can buy on our website. I've just trimmed it, I've put it down to a really small, manageable size. And I'm not going to overcharge the cloth, I'm just going to work it so I'm going to work the surface of the polish here so there's just a fine layer of wax or charge on that cloth. And then I'm going to apply it to the violin very carefully, being careful not to get any in the F hole here, I don't want wax going inside. I don't want any excess wax going on it. So in the same principle that we've waxed many times before and I've shown you dabbing, I'm going to dab this on the surface so it's nice and evenly spread about the instrument. Then very carefully in circles, spreading the wax over the face of the violin here. Being careful not to touch the ebony neck. I don't know how well this is coming out on the camera. We were very privileged to be asked by Malcolm to uh, polish his violin. There you are, it was really quick to, to polish that, to apply the wax polish quite carefully all over the, the violin, being careful not to touch the ebony. So we're going to leave that now overnight and we'll buff it tomorrow and hopefully we will get Malcolm Latcham to come in and see his newly waxed uh, violin and maybe, hopefully, fingers crossed, he might even play it but we don't know that, he hasn't played for a while. 
Right, it's the next day. So let's buff this wax up. Uh, the violin sat here overnight. And hopefully we should see a lovely shine to this violin. Well here we are, there's the, the finished article. We've buffed the polish off of it. It didn't take very long to do, but hopefully you can clearly see the difference there. It looks fantastic. And that will only have to be done, I would have thought probably once every couple of years, depending on how much you use your your instrument but for I would have thought once a couple of years because of the high quality of the wax that we've uh, created all those lovely ingredients in there are going to protect the surface and as you can see it really has added to this violin and hopefully will protect it will help protect it for many years to come it looks fantastic well as you've just seen um, We've got the finished article of this lovely violin uh, and now we have, we've got the owner here, we've got Mr. Malcolm Latcham, which I'd love to present your newly, newly polished violin. Thank oh, you ever so much for allowing us to do that. That's, That's very, yeah. very kind of you. Oh yes, I can see the difference. Looks great. Lovely, That's thank you. Great. Right. Wonderful. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> still sounds the same. I don't still think we've damaged it. Yeah. Hopefully we haven't touched still it. Still sounds the same. Lovely. I think. Thank you ever so much. Course, it's the look. Oh yeah. Wonderful wood. Yeah. Lovely. Oh thank you. Brilliant. Great. Thank you ever so much. Thank I you. hope you get many years of enjoyment out of it still yes. to come. <laughs> 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 Lovely.